Hi, I'm Ryan, and my life is average. Okay, so, you guys really, really, really liked that Jacob Sartorius roast video where I kind of talked about him and the music of people, and because of the thousands of comments, messages, tweets, texts that I've received, everything, I'm going to review his new single, Sweatshirt. For those of you that don't know, watch my last video, but Jacob Sartorius released a single this week called Sweatshirt. It got up to number 10 on the iTunes singles chart, like worldwide of any artist, and now it's like 21 of any song in the world. I predicted that shit. I called it. We're all doomed. Also, this channel went up like 8,000 subscribers this week because of the video, so if you are one of those people that subscribed, thank you so much. Um, super glad to have you here. Hope you stick around. And yeah, it really does mean a lot, so thank you. Now, for the song Sweatshirt, I have not listened to the song yet, okay? I've avoided it, I've avoided the spoilers. People have been sending it to me like crazy, linking it to me, but I have not listened to it because I want to go into this with an unbiased opinion, okay? I'm in my 20s. Okay, I am a scorn old man at this point, but I want to give my best opinion on this and for all I know this song could be somehow good and could be well written, maybe dare I say it could be original. Now the title is Sweatshirt, I can already predict it's going to be about giving a girl her sweatshirt because she's freezing. Okay, so someone was kind enough to upload it to YouTube so I didn't have to buy it, so shout out to the Jacob Sartorius Vivo, fake Vivo channel for uploading it. So without further ado, here is Jacob Sartorius singing his new song, Sweatshirt. Okay. Good guitar riff. Jacob. I literally just got done saying, maybe there's a shot that this song will have original lyrics. And the first verse is a direct copy of Drake in Best I Ever Had. I think it's Best I Ever Had. Yeah, Best I Ever Had. Sweatpants, hair tied, chilling, with no makeup on. All Jacob did, or whoever wrote this song for him, just flip-flopped the words around so that the little girls would be like, Oh, that's not Drake. That's J Jacob. He said it out of order. Watch. Sweatpants, hair tied, chillin' with no makeup on, that's, that's when you're the prettiest. Make up with some sweatpants. <laughs> oh. It took Jacob four seconds to just totally get me annoyed. Let's continue. That's cocky. Okay, you can dream about me all night long. It's a pretty cocky thing to say. Called it. Okay, I said. I said this. Something that can keep you warm. He's gonna give this girl his damn sweatshirt. Oh, whoa! Whoa, whoa, Jacob! Calm your- relax your slacks there, Jacob! R calm it down! You're 13! If you're not ready for my kiss, take this fucking sweatshirt! What a ridiculous thing to be like, can you imagine going in for a kiss, and you're like, okay, and she's like, I'm not ready, and you're like, you know what? That's fine. Here's my hoodie. You can wear my Ugh. Damn! Jacob is clingy! You can tell your friends. <laughs> Listen, we're here for life. Jacob gave me his sweatshirt. He gave me his sweatshirt. That's basically marriage, okay? Forget wedding rings and vows. That means nothing these days. If someone gives me a sweatshirt, we're together forever, no matter what. This ain't a little sixth grade fling. We're not taking part in the spelling bee together. We're not, we're not doing our times tables together. We're freaking married. Yeah! Jacob doesn't want you to be cold, so take his extra small children sized Aeropostel hoodie to keep you cold. But you have to be like four foot one in order for it to fit properly. Repeat. 
literally though like if you think about it he's basically saying like i know you want to flaunt it i'm the shit dude okay i'm a muser i, I do this you know i'm a music lear he's basically saying i know you want to flaunt this you want to walk around and just spin and everybody will drop dead because you are wearing my sweatshirt not them they're freezing but you're not Ooh. that high note Whoa. What exactly do you want to do, Jacob? Jacob, buddy. I hear a little hint of sexualness in this. You already tweeted, is it bad if I haven't made love? We've already said, no, it's not bad. What do you want to do? What is more than this? Maybe play a rousing game of, of heads up? Maybe some taboo? Shoots and ladders? What, 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 what more can you do here? You can wear my sweatshirt. Oh. This is rough. And you can tell your friends We'll be together till the end Girl, you can wear my sweatshirt I feel like Jacob should just redo this, rechange it Do a remix like artists do So we can get more sales Instead of you can wear my sweatshirt You can keep my Webkins, okay? Webkins toys That could be a thing, he's young You can share my baby bottle pop That could be a thing, why not? You could borrow my Snuggie what does, I mean, talk about keeping a girl warm. Yeah, the sweatshirt, that might do the job. But a Snuggie will cover everything. Think outside the box here, Jacob. He's only holding one girl hostage. And that's you. Okay? There's only one girl in Jacob's basement who was giving him musically ideas. And that's you. So be happy. Ooh. Look at that. Woo! Dubstep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dance break. Woo! So you can wear my. So you can wear my sweater. Definitely repetitive. <laughs> it's about 12 lyrics. Although this is better than the Watch Me Whip, Watch Me Nay Nay song, I will give it that, because that song is garbage. It doesn't even flow well, like, it's rust, like, girl, you can wear my sweat. It doesn't even, like, just sound like it flows. Everything just sounds really forced. Now, once again, Jacob isn't a musician. And for a 13-year-old girl, or whatever age you are that you like him, fine. That's fine for you. I can see why you might like this, but a grown man... Come on! This is the most, one of the most cliche songs I have ever listened to. Without even listening to the song beforehand, I predicted almost the entire song. Let's see if something crazy happens. Ooh, that piano. Ooh! Listen to that sweatshirt. Hold on. It's like morning voice. Woo! He was like in the mic like, sweatshirt. Nailed it. The producer's like, the way you said sweatshirt, it sounds like you had morning voice. Boom. Babies are being made, Jacob. Cause you're the only one I hold. Not I don't know if... I want you to be cold. So baby... Oh! My, my, my. Oh! Listen to that ending. They auto-tuned his talking voice. I understand auto-tuning singing. I get it. He's a, he's a young kid going through puberty. It's not going to be great. We know he can't sing. But they auto-tuned his talking voice. <laughs> he can't even talk when the producers didn't like it. Jacob, okay? You can have your damn sweatshirt. Take your damn sweatshirt back. You can have it. I don't want it. A, it won't fit me. Number two, it's not even cold. It's like 65 degrees out right now. Who, what are you trying to give me heat stroke? Also, the, the sweatshirt smells like Hollister cologne and fangirl tears. You gotta wash it. Wash the sweatshirt before you give it to someone. There's stains on it. There's, there's a SpaghettiO stain on the sweatshirt, Jacob. Overall, okay, unbiased opinion. The lyrics are awful, okay? It was produced very well. Whoever produced it, mixed it, 
did all that, did a good job. The sound quality is good. The guitar, the little synth or whatever, like that's not bad, it's not awful, okay? It sounded, sounded like sound production quality, good. It sounded like a song that I'd hear on Radio Disney that way. The lyrics and the singing, just awful, okay? The concept, I get it, it will sell, girls will like it. And the lyrics, literally, the first line of the song just rips a line from a Drake song. Just took it and just ripped it apart. And then the rest of it was just basically repeating the same thing about being cold and wearing a sweatshirt. And once again, this was a top 10 single in the United States. This, top 10. That's why I said artists out there are so furious about stuff like this, because that is a top 10 hit. And songwriters are putting their entire life on pen and paper and writing songs about insane, incredible triumph and difficulties in life. But baby girl, you can have my sweatshirt and you can tell all your fucking friends that we're never leaving. You're gonna be in my basement forever wearing that damn sweatshirt. So get used to it. Number 10 on iTunes, girl. Make it your ringtone. Make it your text tone. Make it your doorbell sound. I could just see this awkwardly playing out like Jacob and a girl in real life. He'd be like, hey babe, you can have my sweatshirt. Oh, it's okay, Jacob, I'm fine, thank you. But Bay, you're gonna be cold. And I don't want Bay to be cold. Bays don't get cold. Jacob, it's 94 degrees out. Why would I need a sweatshirt? Sorry. It's so hot. Just like you. What are you doing? I just thought it would be cute if I covered my eyes like the monkey emoji. Jacob, you need help, okay? Like, you've offered every single girl in this school the sweatshirt. You've offered the librarian your sweatshirt. You tried giving me your sweatpants, your sweat socks. What is your obsession with giving me things? Oh. Okay. You can still have my sweatshirt. So there you have it, okay? This song turned out to be exactly what I thought it would be and I was hoping it would be better. I'm giving credit to the people who produced it, okay? I'm not this crazy bitter old man that just says everything is awful, but come on, I mean, look at the lyrics for yourself and just, what do you think? Comment down below and let me know what you think of the song. If you're a fan of Jacob, that's fine. No one hate that person if they comment. This is a, this is a nice zone. Say why you like the song. If you don't like the song, say why. Let's see in the comments what people think because that's why these videos happen because of you guys and your opinions and if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up all you guys that are active and liking my videos it means a lot and i'm super super happy and excited about that let's see if we can get 10,000. last video i said if we can get 50,000, i'll get a jacob sartorius tattoo it has like 13,000 as of when i'm filming this i will get some sort of little thing i might get a lip tattoo because they go away but i'll do it okay so let's see if we can just get 10,000 for this video in honor of the Sartorius man. And also let me know, do you want to see me make more of these videos? Okay, I'm having fun with these things. These kids are ridiculous. Should I make more or should I just be an adult and stop? Hopefully it's A because I'm having fun with this. And last but not least, make sure to subscribe, click the subscribe button, turn on the notifications, be a part of the average army. Why not? It's just another person to watch and I promise you that I don't suck that much. I suck a little bit. That's what she said. But that's it for me. As always, I will see you guys right here next Friday. And hey, stay average.